We recommend that to start with you practice on light wind days where things happen slowly. When afloat, the first point to understand is when you can actually hoist the sail. And this is best done on a training run. Working together, the helmsman and crew balance the boat to keep it flat. The crew then pulls the spinnaker up using the halyard. This might feel tight because pulling the sail up also pulls the bowsprit out. Watch yourself here as the sail will suddenly pull free from the spinnaker chute, so make sure that you're balanced or even seated to do this. The crew then locks the halyard in the jam cleat. Look above to check the sail is fully hoisted. The crew then moves to pick up the leeward control sheet. This is the one on the same side as the boom. Tension in the spinnaker sheet is crucial to successful spinnaker sailing. To find the best position for the sheet, the crew must constantly be easing and tightening the sheet in small amounts whilst keeping a keen eye on the leading edge of the sail. The crew releases the sheet until the leading edge of the sail just starts to curl. When this point is reached or the sail starts to flap, the crew then pulls the sheet back to the point where the sail stops flapping. This action is continually repeated. As you get better, the leading edge should just be flicking with the sheet being released and tightened by just a few inches at a time. At this point, the sail is set for the optimum airflow and generates the maximum power or drive. Search the channel for the next section of this video. And if you found this video interesting, please don't forget to like us as this will allow us to make more. And subscribe to the channel to receive automatic notifications when we add more videos. Check out the rest of the channel for other topics or visit sailorboat.tv where you can buy the full-length versions or the DVDs and the book to accompany the videos.